What's up, basketball fans? Welcome back to Time Out. Bagi warung gue Ruki Padilla dan kali gue ada di Shanghai untuk NBA China Games Pertanyaannya antara Philadelphia 76ers melawan Dallas Mavericks Dan di video kali ini gue hanya ingin ajak kalian aja untuk melihat suasana di media availability Jadi uh, hari ini kita semua media mendapatkan kesempatan untuk interview pemain-pemain dari Dallas dan juga Philadelphia Dan gue hari ini berkesempatan beruntung banget bisa interview Ben Simmons, Wesley Matthews dan juga Coasters Athletic Bunpo tapi yang paling sayang gue belum dapat interview adalah Dirk Nowitzki nih karena Dirk Nowitzki kan kemungkinan musim depan adalah musim terakhir dia dengan Dallas Mavericks jadi rame banget tadi wartawan yang merubungin dia semoga di kota berikutnya di Sinchen gue bisa mendapatkan interview sedikit aja dengan Dirk Nowitzki kalau gitu guys langsung kita lihat videonya suasana di media availability Ben, since we're in international soil right now, do you have any? Who who is your all-time favorite international player and why? International players? Yes. Dirk. Why? <laughs> First of all, he's in Like Mike. That's one of my favorite movies. Uh, but besides that, he's a freak. You know, the fact he's still playing and getting buckets now, but, you know, the way he plays the game is is uh, unbelievable. Uh, and he's a legend. You know, he's a Hall of Famer. So. I got a lot of respect for him. Who is your favorite all-time international player and why? Um, kind of put me on the spot there. Oh, damn. <laughs> no. Uh, can you come back to me after I think about it for okay, a little bit? Okay, I'll, I'll come to you in the next city. Thank you. <laughs> I'm, I'm wondering, like, how much trash does Joel and you talk during practice? Kind of stop, man. But it's all it's all fun and games. Like if you, if you know him as a person, you know he's gonna uh, bring it to you. You know anytime you're in practice, you know, you know, uh, never heard him talk about trash. Uh, we're we're the same age. Okay. And your school, Westchester High School. Yeah. We play you guys in the Westchester tournament. You guys uh, just scored us. <laughs> probably did. <laughs> by, by, by 60 points. Dang. It was you and I think the other guy was Marcus Johnson. Marcus Johnson might have been gay. I don't know if gay yeah. boy was there. He was really good. Marcus he was, was killing. He went to uh, UConn yeah. for a minute. Um, had a couple guys over to uh, Cal State for the team. Uh, I was on the team. We, we, had, a, we had a good team. Lastly, uh, can you believe two teams passed up on you? Your 19 year old Euro League MVP and the third team traded you. Can you believe it? Because we don't. I mean, it's just the, the choice of the team. So maybe they need a they more needed some other positions, so I'm happy with that. Uh, I'm really happy to be uh, where I am in Dallas. Uh, I think it's the best place. But you mark your calendar when you play them, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's about, yeah. When I play Lakers. <laughs> and what was it like when you met Dr. Nowitzki for the first time? It was crazy. Like, I was just, I, I didn't really talk to him. I was just looking at him. I was looking like every single thing he did, like shooting, how he was like carrying himself. It was just like, I was so uh, surprised. So our first game tomorrow against the 76ers, what are your expectations? 20,000 fans is waiting for you. Wow, I expect to win. <laughs> that's, that's what I expect. This is going to be fun. Uh, I hope the AC is cranking. <laughs> this is going to be hot. <laughs> Hydrating right now as we speak. It's going uh, to be a great experience. Awesome, thanks man. Uh, Wes, what has it been like playing alongside Dirk? Alongside Dirk? Been, I think I've been in front of Dirk. Okay, I've never alongside Dirk. Dirk. It might be my time to retire. <laughs> uh, but to be his teammate has been, it's been an awesome experience. It's been, it's been. Uh, I'm trying to think what the right word. You know, he loves the game. He loves the game. And he devotes everything he has to it. And you, know, you learn about yourself a little bit being around him. You know how he prepares his body and prepares himself for the game practice and shoot around, you know, the time that it takes for him to get ready. You, know, you, you look at yourself, you gotta look at me, I gotta devote a little bit more. You know, to, to see this guy, you know, sometimes barely being able to get out of his seat, <laughs> to, to go out there and compete against 20 year olds, you know, you gotta love the game. Itulah suasana media availability di Shanghai. Semoga kalian enjoy nonton video kali ini. Jangan lupa untuk like, jangan lupa untuk komen, dan jangan lupa juga untuk subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next video. Peace.